Hi, my name is Sunny. And I'm Rebecca. And we are the summer co-op students at the Office of Sustainability here at Western. A project that we are working on this summer is the Green Labs program, where we try to find new ways to make lab spaces more sustainable on campus. One of our ideas is to introduce a recycling pilot within teaching labs. Labs use a large amount of single-use plastics in their day-to-day -day activities, and a lot of the time they end up either in landfill or in our oceans. Currently, these small plastics cannot be recycled in London. However, through facilities management, we were able to purchase two zero-waste boxes from TerraCycle, one for uncontaminated rigid lab plastics and one for uncontaminated latex and natural gloves. TerraCycle is a specialized recycling company that is able to take things that would normally go into landfill and recycle them into new items. We have clarified with TerraCycle and worked together with Health and Safety here on campus in order to draft a set of regulations for using these boxes, since waste from a lab has a higher risk of contamination than waste from other spaces on campus. Starting with the latex and nitro glove box, gloves from any brand may be placed in the box. However, they must not come into contact with any hazardous, corrosive, flammable, or infectious materials. So the general rule is, if it needs to be disposed of through special means, such as going into a bioha biohazard bin, then it must still go into the biohazard bin. If you can throw it into regular garbage, then it can go into the TerraCycle recycling box. The same rules apply for the rigid lab plastics box. This box is for any rigid plastic waste such as pipette tips, micro centrifuge tubes, and PCR tubes. If the plastics have to be disposed of through special means, such as via a biohazard bin, then again it must still go into the biohazard bin. However, plastics that can otherwise be thrown straight into landfill can go into the TerraCycle box. Your professor, laboratory supervisor, and TAs will make it clear to you where your waste can go during lab sessions. If you have any questions, please ask them for clarification. Also, for health and safety regulations, please do not put any waste or materials from other teaching or research labs into the TerraCycle box, even in an effort to reduce waste from other labs. We are very excited about the Green Labs program and this recycling pilot project. It will be a great step towards sustainable consumption and end-of-life management at Western's lab spaces. Visit sustainability.uwo.ca to learn more about what we're doing to make campus greener. And we hope you have a fun and impactful experience in your course.